What's up everyone? It's the 2nd of October, it's a Sunday. I am on my way to a dance hall workshop in Brussels. It's the workshop by Joel Immortal. I think it's the first time he's in Belgium. At least it's the first time for me taking uh, his workshop. Yeah, so I'm really looking forward to it. Really looking forward to it, to learn and to, and to dance um, in Brussels again. It has been a while actually that I've uh, danced here. Let's go. Several days later. So it's Saturday now, actually the weekend after the workshop of Joel. Yeah, I didn't, don't have any footage of that, but it was a really um, great workshop working on things I have never seen before, like specifically the moves of um, Joel's team that I haven't seen before because it's actually the first time I'm taking a workshop of Immortals. So that was a great first experience and I definitely recommend people to uh, check him out. Specifically, if you're in Italy, I know that on the 12th of November, he is teaching a workshop there. So 12th of November, it's a Saturday. You can ask my delicious crew of Rome for more if you, information if you're interested in joining his workshop. This week, we also had another workshop. It was one from Craig from Black Eagles. Coco from Belgium invited him for a workshop um, in Brussels in the evening where he taught us, I think, four different moves. Two of them never seen before and two other them I've seen before in the past, um, like three, four years ago. One of them was so sweet, um, a move that I learned from Prince when he was in at Studio Feeling and then actually Abbey where there's now a challenge for that move that one I saw from Craig actually as well but that's also 2018 2019 in a workshop organized by Groove which is actually two people Marie and, and Matthew so Matthew from Shady Squad who were organizing workshops in Belgium and they did one with Craig a couple of years ago where he uh, taught Abe and which he taught again and this time also with a variation that I haven't seen before so that was also nice one refreshing the moves that i've seen before and actually also adding a variation to to those as well speaking about groove they actually have for an upcoming event groove ladies with three women who will be teaching there so i will put the flyer here and if you're interested be sure to register check them out and yeah you will definitely learn different things and have a lot of fun as well if you've seen my previous vlog from my first battle in Canada, then you know that I got a second place there and the organizers afterwards sent me a little souvenir for that second place. So I will open it uh, here together with you. Um, they sent it to me, they sent it to me and I printed it myself. It's actually this, an award to put in my room so that's that's a great uh souvenir and nice to add something like that to my collection talking about battles and events i will go to poland specifically gdansk next weekend the 15th and the 16th for the dance hall meetup i'm doing the battle of course it's my third time in Poland, my first time was in 2018 where I battled and my second one was second time was in February or March 2019. Haven't been back since, so I'm really excited to go back and see what I can do there at the battle. If you're at the event, come say hi and I hope it's gonna be a great return to Poland. And it also now has a spot against my wall. And actually here you can see um where i keep all my like bracelets from events that i go to whether it's battles or workshops so i keep them here as well as a souvenir and it's getting quite the amount of events that i've been to over the years and one of my favorite flavors of the moment of protein powder is the cappuccino flavor from body and fit so they have a line of vegan products and one of their flavors next to chocolate, vanilla, um, cappuccino, and I think there's another one, but that's the three that I already tried. And up until now, cappuccino is, is really my favorite one. So if you're in the market for a new 
brand of protein power and you want specifically a vegan one or you just want to give it a try then the cappuccino flavor is definitely something to try out and today i've also been updating my playlists uh, with the songs that i've discovered this week that's actually coming from spotify they have a discover weekly that they give you songs that you haven't listened to before or don't have in your library that might be released this month this year or 10 years ago and they also have a playlist with all newly released songs based on your listening history and one of the songs is rich time by shane o that i want to share with you because it's of all the songs that i added this week one of my favorites please don't be sad please don't you cry sometimes life is just not enough when the road get tough i don't know why gonna be so just got out of the shower wrapping up this saturday i hope you're having a great weekend or if you're seeing this during the week i hope you have a great week as always like the video subscribe let me know in the comments if you like the song by shane o and also let me know what your favorite song is of the moment take care and i see you soon Kubo out.